A few more uh, stretches, more extensively going into just what you can do pre and post workouts, uh, kicking and stuff. Um, just help you, you know, always, you want to keep your muscles as fresh as possible. You know, you always want to stay at the top, top of your game, you know, stay as limber and all that good stuff. So basically we went over, you know, the extensions in the leg, the reach downs out here, the IT band stretch, you know, the lunges and all that good stuff. That's kind of like your pre-workout routine just to get the blood flowing, you know, get stretched enough to where you're not going to pull or hurt anything. It's kind of windy. It sucks. Hopefully you can hear me. Yeah. Okay. So after your workout, you want to just take time and uh, really get down to the stretching, you know, hold it for a longer period of time. It helps you get flexible over a period of time, which in the end will make you a better kicker, punter, or kickoff specialist. You dig? <laughs> All right. So basically what I do is, you know, the simple kind of routines, but you want to get serious about it, serious about it, and take your time. It's not fun. No one likes to sit here and stretch in the hot sun, but you got to do it. Go inside or something. All right. So basically just these things right here, where you're just stretching out this muscle, holding it, squeezing your glutes to open up this hip flexor. Yeah, that's what you do. Just like this. Good 10 second count, but I got a 10 minute limit, so we're gonna move it along. You know, you get the other leg, squeeze the glute, you know. And then I kind of just stretch it out here like this, reach my toe, pull it back a little bit. Feel it up here, kind of hurts, but it feels good at the same time. Weird. And of course, I always get both legs. Pull the toe. And then when you get really good, then you can just kind of do the whole split thing, but we're not going to get into that because that's kind of weird. I really don't believe I just did that, but I did. So then this guy, you know, some guys can do it like this, or you can get down on the ground, just pull it back, sit back on it, just hold it there, you know, 10 counts, 15 counts to where you feel comfortable. You also want to get in, stretch it out here, reach out, get both arms over on both sides. You have one of those uh, green cords, not cords, rubbery, what do call it, stretching bands. That. I want to get back here. I'll put it behind my back, bring it around my foot, pull it. I don't have one, I'm broke, okay? Chill out. You pull it as far as you can, then you hold the band, take it out wide, hold that, bring it across, try to stay square. Hold that. <laughs> I feel like I should have my own show or something, like stretching with Delbert Alvarado, part three, you know? Anyway, I'm gonna do that both legs. Then this guy right here, actually this guy right here too, get this part of the lower back, glute, the isometric muscle, huh, made that up. And just kind of twist, you know? Get loose, feel good. The butterfly always works. I'm not laughing, I'm talking. This stuff really works. It helps, okay? It helps you out a lot. You wanna shave your cleats down. And yeah, that's about it, you know? Just do those old right over left, left over right deals. And just take your time. Stretching's important, that's my point. If you don't stretch, you're gonna struggle, you're gonna pull muscles. Thank God I never pulled a muscle yet. I won't. But you wanna always stay healthy, because it's important. It's part of our job, it's part of what we do as kickers punters and kickoff specialists we need these guys you know so you just always want to take care of them drink a lot of water do a lot of stretching and uh, stay tuned because I'll help you get right I promise <laughs>